do you become a multi-planet civilization or not? And if you don't, it's simply a matter of time before something happens on your planet. The billion dollar telescope is the largest and most powerful in space. It captured these images. The James Webb Space Telescope is upsetting the apple cart. All of a sudden we realize that we may have to rewrite all the textbooks about the beginning of the universe. The James Webb Telescope has captured something truly astonishing. Lights that resemble those from a city shining from a distant 0.7 trillion miles away. This discovery has sparked interest in the possibility of life beyond Earth. The telescope zeroed in on Proxima Centauri b, the closest exoplanet to our solar system, and found strange bright lights. Could these lights be signs of another civilization? Let us explore how the James Webb Telescope uncovered these phenomena that will change our understanding of the universe. Distant glimmers of alien life have long excited researchers and regular folks alike. Any small bit of evidence that hinted at the possibility of something out there was eagerly welcomed. Then came a groundbreaking moment and the James Webb Space Telescope provided clear signs of life somewhere in space. As it explored the vastness of space, this powerful telescope spotted something intriguing on Proxima Centauri b, an exoplanet far away. It noticed lights that looked similar to the lights you see in cities on Earth, suggesting the possible existence of an alien city on this distant planet. This idea has sparked a lot of excitement and curiosity among scientists. They are intrigued because this might just be the kind of discovery they've been hoping for. It suggests that there could be intelligent beings out there organizing their societies in ways we can't yet fully comprehend, and we're just now beginning to see evidence of it. Looking at these distant city-like lights, which are a staggering 7 trillion miles away, NASA engineers are amazed and wonder how long these lights have been visible in space, just waiting for us to finally have the technology to see them. David Kipping, an astronomer at Columbia University, described the planet where these lights were found as quite complex. This is because, unlike most rocky planets that absorb sunlight and release infrared energy, this exoplanet behaves differently due to its unique relationship with its host star, Proxima Centauri. This finding by the James Webb Space Telescope highlights its importance. The telescope's ability to pick up infrared wavelengths was key in detecting the unusual thermal signature of Proxima b, which is crucial for understanding the planet's atmospheric conditions. Researchers plan to continue using this telescope to delve deeper into the atmosphere of this planet and even explore whether it might be habitable. The James Webb Telescope is particularly sensitive to infrared light, which allows it to observe what happens on Proxima Centauri b during the night. For many space telescopes, it's difficult to detect faint lights in the vast darkness of space, but the James Webb Telescope can see even the smallest glimmers of light. This makes it an ideal tool to confirm whether the so-called city lights on the dark side of Proxima b are real. The telescope can detect any man-made light in space if it falls within a very narrow frequency band, much narrower than regular starlight. Proxima b has a dynamic relationship with its star. On the daytime side of the planet, numerous solar panels capture the powerful energy of the star, and its spectral edge also reflects light. As the planet orbits around Proxima Centauri, it experiences day and night cycles similar to those on Earth, with intense heat during the day and cooler temperatures at night. The planet experiences significant temperature differences, which are largely determined by its makeup. For instance, if Proxima b lacks an atmosphere, the temperature difference between day and night would be extreme. Without the moderating effects of atmospheric gases or oceans, the day side would get extremely hot while the night side would fall into freezing temperatures. This dramatic temperature variation is a key area of interest for astronomers, as it offers insights into the atmospheric composition of Proxima b. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unmatched infrared imaging capabilities, can effectively analyze the planet's thermal emissions, providing valuable data on its atmospheric properties. Interestingly, 
The orbit of the James Webb Telescope around Earth matches the orbital period of Proxima b, allowing for comprehensive observations of its day and night every 11.2 Earth days. If the planet indeed has an atmosphere, the next step will be to examine its atmospheric chemistry to determine if it can support life. Signs such as the presence of oxygen, water vapor, and methane would indicate habitable conditions. If these elements are present on the planet, it would confirm its potential to support life. This requires precise capture and analysis of light passing through the planet's atmosphere, a challenging task. Although the James Webb Telescope has excellent capabilities for characterizing planetary atmospheres, it is primarily designed for other tasks. It specializes in analyzing variations in the concentrations of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. While it has some limitations in detecting bonded oxygen, a crucial indicator of life, the telescope is also equipped to search for other important elements like ozone, which is a good indicator of a healthy atmosphere. As scientists consider the James Webb Space Telescope's findings, the search to explore faraway worlds grows, bringing us closer to knowing if we're alone. Exploring new worlds with Webb, it's important to remember that the James Webb Space Telescope can only observe a limited number of the closest habitable worlds to Earth. For more detailed atmospheric studies, astronomers are turning to ground-based observatories like the Extremely Large Telescope ELT, which is set to begin operations in 2028. The ELT is designed to provide deeper insights into the atmospheric structures of distant exoplanets, offering detailed and clear data on their potential to support life. Scientists are eagerly waiting for the operation of future space telescopes like the ELT. In the meantime, however, the James Webb Space Telescope remains an essential tool in our quest to explore distant exoplanets. Despite its limitations, the Webb Telescope continues to offer profound insights that could revolutionize our understanding of what lies beyond our solar system both now and in the future. Researchers have big plans for the space telescopes of tomorrow. They want to tone down the bright glare of stars so we can get a better look at the planets orbiting them. Think of it like using your hand to block the sun on a bright day so you can see better. By reducing the starlight, these future telescopes will have a clearer view to study the faint light bouncing off distant planets. This will help them analyze the planet's atmosphere and check if it could support life. But this task isn't straightforward. Scientists will need to tell the difference between gases produced by living things and those from natural planetary activities like volcanoes. They're really committed to getting to know these far-off planets better so they can spot real signs of life and not get fooled by natural processes that look similar. The Webb Telescope is giving us a sneak peek at what these future studies might uncover. As we continue to push the boundaries of our knowledge and exploration of space, we get closer to understanding the complex universe and our place in it. Since the dawn of time, humans have wondered if we're alone in the universe. This question still drives many scientific studies today. Right now, the James Webb Telescope is out there in space, checking out different planets and moons to see if any might be home to alien life. A lot of people now think that aliens might actually exist somewhere in the cosmos, just waiting for us to discover them. To try to answer this age-old question, two American astronomers, Jill Tarter and Thomas Pearson, started a project in 1984 called the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence SETI. They set up a non-profit to listen for radio waves from space because radio waves can travel really far without getting lost or absorbed. That's why they're using the Allen Telescope Array in the mountains of California, which has 42 radio telescopes just for this purpose. Despite looking for over 30 years, SETI hasn't found any radio signals that can definitely be said to come from aliens, but Jill Tarter is still hopeful. She believes that with today's technology, they might finally find something. She's even said she hopes everyone on Earth will join in this exciting search for company in the cosmos. 
Recently, there's been some buzz because NASA reported that the James Webb Space Telescope might have seen lights from a city on a planet not too far from Earth. The JWST is really the best tool we have for exploring space right now. It's hanging out a million miles away from Earth, sending back detailed info about the oldest parts of the universe. It's specially designed to pick up details that we've missed before, helping us understand how galaxies, stars, and planets form. Astronomers are making the most of the JWST's advanced tech, like its super sharp camera and special filters, to look at and understand the subtle colors around stars and planets. They rely on this telescope to learn about the physical and chemical makeup of places that are light years away. By picking out certain wavelengths of light, the Webb telescope isn't just observing, it's actively searching the atmospheres of other planets for the tiniest hints of life. Using its unmatched ability to sift through space and time, it's already made some mind-blowing discoveries, like finding way more mass in the universe than we thought, hidden in big galaxies. This has made scientists rethink some of their ideas about how the universe started and grew. With each new discovery from the JWST, our drive to understand distant planets deepens, expanding what we know about life beyond Earth. New clues in the quest for aliens, humanity is now using the JWST to go deeper into space than we've ever gone before. It's helping us gather information on remote worlds, providing new insights that could solve some big questions about these distant planets. Twenty years ago, we barely knew anything about planets outside our solar system. But since then, astronomers have found over 4,000 exoplanets orbiting distant stars, showing just how far we can stretch our curiosity and technology. Yet NASA thinks these discoveries are just the beginning. They believe there are actually trillions of exoplanets out there waiting to be found. Scientists haven't stopped their space explorations, hoping to find places where aliens might live. Every so often, they get a hint that they might be on the right track. For instance, when the Galileo spacecraft went to Jupiter, it accidentally found a sign that might suggest life, hidden in the ice. Even though it wasn't a planned part of the mission, this discovery has inspired scientists to keep looking for unexpected clues as they study other planets and moons in space. Right now, NASA is really interested in the frozen moons of Jupiter and Saturn, like Europa and Enceladus, because they think these icy worlds could have the right conditions for life. They're planning more missions to look for signs of life in these places. While some scientists focus on looking for alien signals or studying the atmosphere of planets for clues of life, others are thinking even further ahead, imagining what could be possible in the future. As technology improves and our tools for exploring space get even better, our understanding of space will also grow. New missions to search for life are already being planned. These missions will be more advanced, helping us to dig even deeper into the mysteries of the universe and perhaps, finally answer that age-old question, are we alone in the cosmos? The information collected by the James Webb Space Telescope and other future space missions will be crucial in helping us find the answer. As we push the boundaries of space exploration, we get closer to understanding the complexities of the universe and our place within it. With every new discovery, we inch closer to a future where the possibility of finding life beyond Earth becomes a reality. So, as we continue to explore the vastness of space, let's keep our minds open to the wonders that await us and the discoveries that lie ahead. The universe is full of possibilities, and with the James Webb Space Telescope leading the way, we are on the brink of uncovering some of the most profound secrets of our existence. If you were fascinated by the possibility of finding extraterrestrial life and are curious about more such mysterious and thrilling stories, make sure to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any updates. Also, don't forget to check out our previous video on the James Webb Telescope where we discuss how this amazing piece of technology is helping us explore the furthest reaches of space. See you in the next video.